Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to discuss my favorites of the month of March. Now I buy a lot of stuff. I get a lot of stuff. And this video is in no way sponsored, but these are the things that I thought were really useful for me and I'm super happy with it. So I wanted to make like a product favorites video to show you what I got. And I always absolutely love to watch those videos myself because there are so many things that you haven't even thought about there. You're like, oh my God, I need to have that. Today I have all kinds of things for you from skincare to makeup to things for your hair, things for in your closet. I have outfits, um, all kinds of things that we're going to discuss that are my current faves and I use a lot. Now, before we continue this video, I would love to ask you to subscribe to my channel. It means a lot to me and I'm currently working on so many cool things for you guys. So I would highly appreciate that. First things first, I absolutely love a natural makeup look. I think you girls and guys know that by now that if I wear makeup, it's not a lot, but it does need to give like that little extra spark. Um, so I got a makeup palette, which is from NARS. Um, at first I was like, what's this like i i don't i didn't know what what was but now i am living for this palette literally i'm using this thing every single day it's called the nars summer lights face palette on top it has three different kind of eyeshadows which is really really gorgeous especially for the glowy dewy kind of skin look and what i love about the colors is that they're matte but there's also like a slight shimmer in a few of them so here we have a bronzer and you have a highlighter at the same time now girl if you match these two i'm wearing it right now i mean it looks so natural and like i said i'm using this thing every day every day i really wonder how long this is going to take for me to run out of but this is definitely my favorite palette and i have a lot but currently i'm just using this one now talking about faces have you girls seen those trends on tiktok that women shave their face at first i was like oh my god i don't dare i, I still don't dare to do that so that's a little bit too far for me but what i do use are the razors so i got this at shein the very cheap website by the way and i got six razors in this now what you can use this for is to like put it between your eyebrows you can do your eyebrows on the side you can even do the, your upper lip and everything while it um, removes the hair of course because that's what it's for um, it also exfoliates your skin which leaves it super super smooth so you get like six razors in one packet and like i said this costs nothing in all kinds of cute colors and you have this as you can see it's like a little razor blade and what you can do is you put it on your skin and you move it down slightly be very gentle because if you do this too hard your skin will turn red because it removes like the first layer of your skin which has a lot of dead skin cells but these are things i use almost on a daily basis and then especially on my upper lip and like my eyebrows and it becomes so so soft so this is my go-to at the moment. I'll definitely let you know if I ever dare to shave my face with it. Um, they said in those TikTok videos and on YouTube that your hair doesn't grow back thicker. But to be honest, I don't believe it. I'm Mexican. Like my hair is already super thick and I don't dare to do it. If anyone has experience with it, let me know. I don't know about you, but my closet is a mess. I have a walk-in closet which is completely full with all kinds of stuff and even then I have a mess and I don't have enough space for my clothing to hang. And besides that, when I travel, um, when I used to travel, because now with COVID, of course, no one's going nowhere. But you know, back in the day when I used to travel, I never had like the, the space to hang my things. Now, I also found this on the website Shein and it's a clothing rack kind of thing. It looks like really cheap and and. Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't cost anything, but it's the most handy thing ever. So you get these in three pieces. You click all of them together. And what you can do is hang this in your closet and put all of the clothing hooks in here. So you get like a whole rack of clothing, but it doesn't take space. You can also put it straight. And even then it really saves a lot of space. So I bought only two 
I really regretted that. I should have bought more. But I'm going to try these out in my closet. And what I thought, when I'm going to travel again, this thing weighs literally nothing. I think like 200 grams or something. And how cool would it be if you can just put this in your suitcase? And when you're in your Airbnb, just hang it on the door. You can put all your clothing racks on here instead of in a musty closet or something, wherever you are at that moment. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely going to try out more with this, but it's such a simple invention that makes my life easier. Now, you girls know that I take a lot of care of my hair because my hair is like my trademark. I don't know. It's just a very, very important thing to me that my hair is always healthy and just glowing and shining and stuff i just think it's it's like a feature it can bring so much beauty out on its own so i love to take care of my hair um you know that my hair grows like freaking crazy but what i did notice is because i dye my roots a little bit darker at the hairdresser um because then my eyes pop out more i just like that more but my scalp is so sensitive and it became very flaky it became itchy it became red and especially because i work out so much with the sweat and the already irritation that was there, my skin was going freaking crazy. So what I got um, was again, a very cheap product, but I never imagined it would work that well. Hello, snoozer. You wanna be in a video, Chunky? <laughs> you will be managing the product's reviews. Hmm? It is called the Scalpologist. I absolutely love the name because this is literally made for your scalp and scalp only. And it is called the Mental and Walnut Shells Pre-Wash Scalp Scrub. It is supposed to be soothing and balancing for dry and flaky scalp. And it has 97% natural ingredients, which is a lot. And besides that, it's perfume free. So I was skeptic about this. I just found this at a dollar store in Harlem in the old city where I used to live. I'm pretty sure you can get this in a lot of countries because they also sell it online. I thought, you know what, why not just try it? Because I was going crazy of the itch and the redness and oh my God, my hair was becoming greasy and I just needed to have a solution for that. This is just a scrub for your scalp. And what it says is that you, when you wetten your hair um, under the shower, you put this on your head and you start massaging it in. And I tried it. And holy crap, this works. This freaking works. I was so excited when I came out of the shower because it felt good, it felt rinsed, but at the same time moisturized. Girl, this saved me. And it's not even a high-end product. That's what I love about it. And besides that, it smells like menthol. I will try to find a link for you girls for this product. Um, and if you're in the Netherlands, I bought this at the store Normal. You know that one, like the action, but then different. Um, it's called normal and you can get that there. Now, what I'm always searching for is jeans and clothing that enhances my natural curves, but at the same time fits. I mean, girl, like the, the jeans I buy at normal stores that are not made for people who have curves or just wider hips in general, they just don't fit. Now, the problem I always have with normal jeans is that at my quads, the fabric is almost ripping. Then I have my butt, which is very tight. And at my waist, the seam is way too loose. And almost never I find a good jeans, but now I did. I highly recommend the jeans from Uniqlo, by the way. I did mention them once in, I think it was a, a haul or something, but the jeans from Uniqlo uh, are really good too. But now I have fit jeans. They brought out a flared out jeans that fits your hips, okay? Can we just take a moment for that? Because I've never ever in my life found a jeans that fit my hips, my butt, my quads and everything at the same time. I'm wearing an extra small of these and I love the looks you can create with this. The fabric is really, really stretchy as you can see here. This is always the first thing I do when I'm in a store and I want to test out like the quality of our jeans. <laughs> I'm like, yo. Is it stretchy or not? 
So Fit Jeans is definitely um, a jeans brand that I would recommend highly if there are never jeans for you that you fit. Um, you might work out a lot, you might have like the biggest curves ever which are beautiful. Go and buy Fit Jeans because these are the jeans that actually fit your waist and everything at the same time. Now I'll put my measurements in this description box down below. Um, I wear a size extra small of everything just because everything is super stretchy and that makes it very easy for me to fit everything while sizing down. I would recommend to go through my measurements and like compare it for yourself so you can check out um, the sizing etc. All in all this is my favorite jeans at the moment and I wear it a lot. Almost too many times for the week but this is my absolute favorite. Now another thing for my hair is a good brush. I was going crazy of my frizzy hair because the thing with me is I have a little bit of an oily scalp sometimes because I work out a lot and then I have my ends which are a little bit drier and I always got this one. This was a brush, it's called a finger brush so um, you can basically go through your hair with it very easily but this always makes my hair frizzy frizzy as hell because it's only plastic so this one is going into the garbage and i found a replacement brush which is basically the same it also has the plastic sticks right here but what it also has and that's an addition to it is that it has the hairs in between the plastic that doesn't make your hair frizzy is actually anti-frizz it's called the finger brush by olivia garden now i paid i think it was like 30 euros for this one. It was a lot for a brush. I'll be honest, it was a lot for a brush, but look at it. It doesn't become frizzy. I can go through my hair easily. And what I love about it is that also when I just got out of the shower, I can even brush my hair then because it doesn't pull your hair. It's anti-frizz. It makes your hair more shiny than it was. And besides that, it's anti-breakage because normally when I would do my hair with this one, can literally take out a chunk of hair after washing my hair. It's terrible. I'm like a freaking cat. Walking through the house after I wash my hair, there's hair everywhere. So I made the switch to this one and I'm super happy with it. I have the finger brush combo medium, by the way. I wouldn't be me if I wouldn't throw in some skincare in this video. I am a little bit too obsessed with skincare. But it's good because then I can, in the end, always recommend you products which I really like and which work for me. <laughs> Anyways, the problem I always had was that I had a little bit of a texturized, bumpy um, skin on my bum. And I had no freaking idea what it's from. Um, maybe it's because I wear a lot of jeans, maybe it's because I wear a lot of leggings. I had no idea and no body lotion was helping for that. I also had like rough patches on my face sometimes and like my elbows and every body lotion that I tried was either too greasy that made it like sticky or my skin didn't really absorb it and it was like on the surface and didn't do much. So a few months back I got the Ameliorate Smooth Skin Science Transforming Body Lotion. <gasps> in a PR package and it was just a tiny container but I thought you know what let's just try it out so I put it on my bum I put it on my face I put it on my elbows I put it everywhere where there was bumpy skin and oh, wow so I thought okay maybe it only works on me I just wanted to try it out and I told my friend who's staying over here right now um, that she needed to try it too like okay let me know your thoughts on this because maybe it only works for me um, she has like that bumpy skin on her arm you know a little bit like a chicken skin I think that's what they call it and because there's acid in this that actually exfoliates the skin while moisturizing it that makes it that it has so many benefits for bumpy skin and rough skin and dry skin and everything skin that after only one day of trying this stuff out it was gone and she was as excited as I am so I got the bigger version <laughs> and I'm gonna take a long while with this because like I said I only use it for patches here and there so I don't need that much so this is definitely one of those staples in my skincare routine that I always use and I think I'm gonna get one of these tiny ones again for my bag or something um, and like I said the name is Ameliorate smooth skin science so that one is really like a staple in my whole skincare routine right now then moving forward 
you already see it like this color is freaking everything this is my most loved set from gymshark at this moment they brought out a new vital seamless color hello what do you want hmm? he always watches birds and ducks from this chair so hello everyone this is louise our next assistant for this product review <laughs> So they have it in shorts. It comes with a matching sports bra. Now the only branding that it has on it is on the front of all the products. And I think I would say that this sports bra is like medium support. They also made a full length leggings of it in the same color again. And this range is freaking everything. On the back, it does have like a little seam. It looks a little bit 3D and that is, I think, why this collection is like bomb and popping because it gives you curves, it gives you more support everywhere and it's just freaking amazing. So Gymshark, you did very well. From the 14th of April, they are gonna have a Gymshark sale. Only for Europe, by the way, and for selected lines only, but it's up to 50%. So if you want to check that out, I will definitely try and make a, a separate haul for that but just so you know it already so if you're in europe note it in your calendar right now 14th of april 8 p.m cet there will be a huge gymshark sale now the last thing i want to discuss with you is such a tiny product it's this <laughs> and i'll be honest i would never have thought of myself using this i was getting a little bit irritated skin of the normal deodorants i always used and i was smelly even though i exfoliated and i was like what the hell is happening so i was searching on the internet like what could cause that and it said that it's actually a little bit of buildup in your system right here of the deodorant that actually makes the smell and the gunky funk in there um which is really bad for you and i was like shit i want to use deodorant but at the same time i also want to take care of my skin because I think it's very important. I even got like a little bit of discoloration right there from the use of deodorant. So I thought I need to find something else. So I searched on Google, I searched for natural deodorants. I thought maybe that was a thing. I tried out a few things and it was absolutely horrible. I mean, you have those sea salt deodorants, which just basically suck i don't know if you girls have any different experience with it but i really didn't like it and i came on a website which is called nude literally n-u-u-d nude <laughs> and it said that they made deodorant which is actually good for your skin and at the same time kills bacteria that actually causes your armpit to smell so i was like whoa wait I need that. I definitely need that. In normal deodorants, there's a lot of aluminum, which is really bad for your skin and your system in general. And what they did in this is they used silver. I thought, what the hell is this? So I needed to try it. So I ordered like a test package and I got one of these. Now with this, I do at least six to eight weeks. And I even got Jeremy to switch to this. So at first, like the first three days, I was like, oh my God, I smell bad. I smell bad but that's what the website says it can take up to a week for your skin to adjust to the new deodorant and it's actually more like a paste so I don't know if you girls can see it but it's white white grayish and you only need a pea size of deodorant and you use it like every other day or something um, to put on your skin and I don't smell myself anymore I was like what is this magic my skin is not red anymore my skin is not discolored anymore and this stuff is soft for your armpits too so i knew i needed to put it in my product review so these were all my product recommendations for the month of march i really hope that you enjoyed it let me know which product was your favorite and if you would like me to make more of these videos because these are literally things that i was so excited about and i knew i needed to share with you so for now thank you so much for watching me and snoozer are logging off goodbye people thank you so much and i'll see you in the next video